Okay, children. Today, <coughs> let us study about the lesson. Our day is the option. This is the first lesson in English standard, second language English. A day in the Asham by C. F. Andrews. So before going to the lesson, let us learn about the brief history about the Asham. Okay? Yes. Shantri Ketan is a neighborhood of Bolapur city in Dirbam district in West Bengal, India. It was established by Devendranatha Tagore and later expanded by his son Rabindranatha Tagore. Presently it is called as Vishwabharati University. In 1901, Rabindranath Tagore started a school at Shantani Ketan. It was named Pata Bhavana. And started with only five students. So, this is a brief history about the Ashram. Madhurige, Pashtuno Bangarada, Bolapur city Pakadale, Idana, or Tandavara is the Kanta, the Venus of the Tango Dauro, Sakna Manta, Nanta Evana, expand Manta. Igaduna, presently it is called as Vishwabharati University. In 1901, the Tango Dauro, as Santi Ketana, Shale Nataramba, Manta, Aduna. Mother is a part of our family. And then, let us learn about the author. The author who wrote this lesson, C.F. Handels. C.F. Handels. So, Open our textbook. Here you can see the picture of C. F. Andrews here. Okay? Yes. C. F. Andrews, Charles Free Andrews, his full name. Charles Free Andrews. 1871 to 1940. He was born in 1871 and died in 1940. He was an English priest of the Church of England. He was an educator and Indian freedom fighter. He became Mahatma Gandhi's closest friend and associate. Andrews reveals his experience while he, while he stayed in the ashrama. Shantani Ketan was founded by Rabindranath Tagore. It is a school with a difference where students learn with great job. Guru English show, Patriya Gidra. Guru Sikshakar Kudado. Mata Satantra Varata Gaza Kudayatare. Gandhi Javana Aptas Nayatru Mata Aura Jatigaru Kuda Ayatara. So in this lesson, he is going to tell about his experience. In the ashram. Ashram of the Ladin Tandupo the Baki Patriata, Okare. So it is a school with a difference. This school is different from other schools. It is very shallow again. Once in the age of the Vinavarita Kata, Shalay Valley. Illy Makla, the children learn with great job. To Masanto in the culture. Now, <coughs> Have you learnt about the author? Yes, okay. Now, shall we start this? Yes. <coughs> so, while I am reading, listen to me very carefully. 
वर्ड्स कैन नॉट पिक्चर टू यू द ब्यूटी ऑफ शांति केतन अवर ओन पॉइंट और टीचर हु वी कॉल गुरुदेवा हैज नेम डिट इन सॉन्ग द डॉलिंग ऑफ ऑल आर्ट्स एंड इट इज वर्थी ऑफ द नेम हाउ वी हैव विजिटेड द आश्रम ओल्ड एंड यंग लाइफ they have felt its inner beauty growing more and more upon them if i were to describe to you one day in the ashrama with the boys that would perhaps best bring home to you its inner beauty long before sunrise like the birds in our own amloki grows our boys are away the foresters are the first to rise and they go around the ashram singing their morning hymn you can hear the voices in the distance drawing nearer and nearer and then the sound dies away as the choir passes on to another part of the ashram and then again it comes nearer and nearer the beauty of the sound in the silent morning air and the sense of joy and reverence which it brings give peace to the soul after an interval each boy takes his asana a square of carpet into the fields and sits down on it to meditate in his own place alone later on before the school work begins the boys all stand together in the shade of the trees and sing their hymn till about half past 10 the work of the school goes on we have no classrooms the boys sit with their teachers in the open air under the trees there are no larger classes a group of 8 or 10 boys are seated round the teacher asking him questions very few books are used a greater part is carried on through conversation the boys soon learn to open out all the difficulties to their teachers and the teachers get keenly interested in the boys questions and answers such living education can never be dull when the morning work is over the boys both and go to their meal about 2 o'clock in the afternoon the class will begin again but at this time the work is chiefly with the hands as well as with the mind hand in work is practiced and the boys own natural tastes are very soon discovered so prefer carpentry others prefer mechanical work others enjoy spinning and weaving others become skilled draftsmen or painters others are Visions. There is very little book work in the afternoon. School is over at about four o'clock, and then there is a rush to get first into the great open fields for football. Our Swatini Ketan boys are famous everywhere for their sports and games. in the evening at sunset they return from the fields and sit down once more for a short time to meditate in silence as night comes fairy tales are told short dramas are recited our gurudeva songs are sung and different school gatherings are held 
By 9 o'clock, all are glad to retire to rest. And again the foresters go around the ashrama, singing their last evening hymn. There can be no question as to the happiness of the life of our boys. The faces tell the story of their joy and their freedom. There is no freer life in India than the life of our children at Chantani. Yes. Have you understood the lesson? First, let us know about the difficult words. When we come across the lesson, we find some new words or difficult words. We need to understand the words to understand the lesson properly. We can make use of the dictionary to understand the new words or difficult words. Now, we can see some new words in the glossary. Gurudeva. Gurudeva Andrayaro. Rabi Dunata Tagore. Karishtas. Hardware Choir, a group of singers singing hymns. Hymn, a song of praise to God. Stotra, Devana Kutta Artha Kantavandu, Stotra. In the same way, there are some new words in the lesson. So, now, <coughs> I want to Make use the new words in our own sentences. Can you use the new words in your own sentences? For example, reverence. Have you heard the word reverence? Reverence. So, sorry a bit. Children, it's a very simple word. Can you use it in your own sentence? Yes. We should have respect. We should have reverence for our elders. We should have reverence for our elders. In the same way, <coughs> recite. Kanta Pada Madhya recite. Kanta Pada Madhya, here we take a revision to Kathiwe, recite. So, can you use it in your own sentence? Yes. 
our teacher asked us to recite the first poem our teacher asked us to recite the first So, another uh, new word, Dhyadani. Dhyadani. Can you use it in your own sentence? Yes, you can use it in your own sentences. Meaning, Usually, our school gatherings will be held in the month of March. Our school gathering will be held held in the month in the month of March. In the month of March. Usually. In the month of March. So another word is here glad. Glad means happy. Glad means happy. Can you use it in your own sentence? Glad. Happy. Can you? Yes. Children are glad to see the circus. Children are glad to See the focus. Makkal, circus and the mother of the Tumbas of Shona, but they are very happy to see the circus. In the same way, we need to understand the new words or difficult words to understand the lesson properly. So, we can make use of the dictionaries to know the meanings. Then only you will be able to understand the lesson very easily and meaningfully. Now, so let us understand about the lesson. Let us understand about the lesson. In the beginning, the author told about the beauty of the ashram, the beauty of Shantani Ketana. The beauty of Shantani Ketana is beyond description. We can't describe the beauty of Shantaniketa. So Gurudeva, Ms. Rabindranath Tagore called it, called the Shantaniketa, the darling of our hearts, the darling of our hearts. So it is worthy of the name. Yidu Vadaki Gurudeva Vadaki. So, the beauty of Shantani Ketan was attracted by the people, the maybe old or young. They were attracted by the beauty. Its beauty 
growing more and more upon them. Next. <clears throat> so the Deng Shantani Ketan begins long before sunrise. Long before sunrise. Like the birds, the foresters are the first to rise. And then they go around the ashrama with singing their morning hymn to wake up other boys. And then <coughs> After an interval, sort of Viramada Nantara, the boys goes to take their asanas. They used to sit on the carpet to meditate. The boys used to meditate in silence. And then, before the school starts, they used to stand together in the shade of the place and sing their hymn. Tarakati Guru Prarabha Vakinta Madhulo Maradhan Nalindalli Nintho Oro Hadana Yedtai Nantara Ali They have no classrooms. The boys used to sit with their teachers under the trees in group of eight or ten. They used very few books. Most of their learning activities carried through conversation. The children used to ask questions to their teachers. The teachers also used to ask questions to the students and used to answer the questions. So, in this school, the children learn to ask questions, learn to open out their open, open out their mouth in the beginning. Teachers also very interested in the students' question and answers. Such living education can never be done. Chai Sachini Kachadubuti Gul Samuadu Gamulakan at that. After the morning work, <coughs> The boys go to take the meal <coughs> and then they used to practice handy work. Handy work. Here their natural tastes were very <coughs> soon discovered. <laughs> The children were given an opportunity to develop their taste. If a boy has interest in carpentry work, so he was given an opportunity to do the carpentry work. In the same way, painting. If a boy has interest in painting. So he will be given an opportunity to do the work. Some children prefer mechanical work. Some children prefer spinning and weaving as their best. After a little book work, they ran to the field to play football. 
तो शांतरी केतन बॉयस आर वेरी फेमस इन स्पोर्ट्स एंड गेम्स दे वर वेरी मच इंटरेस्ट इन स्पोर्ट्स एंड गेम्स आफ्टर द क्लास वर्क दे आर हैंड टू द फील्ड टू प्ले फुटबॉल इन द इवनिंग वंस अगेन दे रिटर्न फ्रॉम द फील्ड एंड सिट डाउन टू मेडिटेट फॉर अ शॉर्ट टाइम वंस अगेन दे आर यूज टू मेडिटेट इन यूनिंग लॉस So when night comes, the children are told fairy tales. They are told short dramas. So they are going to recite dramas, and Guru Deva's songs. By noon o'clock, they are very happy to retire to rest. After noon o'clock, they are going to take rest. In the same again, the characters go around the ashram, singing their last evening hymn. Very good, and they Sanjay Kuda characters of ashram are Sutta Adota Okta. the children in santani ketan was very very happy there is no question to their happiness their faces tell the story of their joys and their freedom yes i think i hope you have understood the lesson properly so now now i am going to ask you some questions related to the lesson i am going to ask you the very simple questions yes <clears throat> who named the school chatniketan option is okay Who named the school Shantini Ketan? Ah, uh, Shala ke Shantini Ketan aur dekhte hain toh yaar. Who named the school Shantini Ketan? Ah, uh, yes. Rabindranath Tagore named the school Shantini Ketan. I would like to ask you the next question. When does the day in Shantani Ketan begin? When does the day in Shantani Ketan begin? Yes. The day in Shantani Ketan begins long before sunrise. long before sunrise when does the day in shantani ketan begin the day in shantani ketan begins long before sunrise yes What is termed by Gurudeva as 
the dawning of our eyes. Tagore Auro, how the dawning of our eyes in the Kandu? What is termed by Gurudeva as the darling of our hearts? Ah, yes. Shantani ki kandu. Rabindrata Tagore Term, the Shantani Ketan has the darling of our hearts. Hello, the song will be a Shantani Ketan of the darling of our hearts. Yes. <coughs> So who are the early risers in the ashram? And who are the early risers in Shantan Kiyo? Yes, come on. Who are the early risers in Shantan Kiyo? Ah, yes. Choristers are the early risers. Parishtas are the early places. Early places. You have a lot of names in the second paragraph. Second paragraph. Then, <clears throat> but what time do Shantani Ketan boys go to bed at night? But what time do Shantani Ketan boys go to bed at night? Come on. Answer this question. What? At what time do Shantani Ketan boys go to bed or play? The boys go to bed. Nine o'clock. Nine o'clock. The boys go to bed at nine o'clock at night. The boys. Go to bed at nine o'clock. At night. How many hours? In the afternoon, what time do you sleep? Yeah, around twelve o'clock. What time do you? So I want to review once again. Who visited the school one day? Who visited the school one day? And this is our Ashram Ke Bete Putan Tawriya. Ah, yes, C.F. Andrews. C.F. Andrews. What do the faces of the boys tell? What does the faces tell? What do the faces of the boys tell? Yes. <coughs> the boys' faces tells us. Come on, tell me. What does the boy? What uh, do the boys' faces tell? Tell. Come on. Yes. The boys' faces tell the joy and freedom. The boys faces tell 
a bolt of joy. And freedom. And fit. So, <clears throat> and then we need to learn about some more. Items in the exercise. For example, antonyms. So, shall I repeat? So some words are given, some antonyms are given in the textbook. For example, rich, antonym means opposite. Rich, what is the antonym of the word rich? Or what is the opposite word of rich? Yes, poor. Opposite of rich is poor. And then <coughs> tall. The antonyms are given in sentences like Krishna was a rich king while his friend was a Dash man. Poor man. In the same way, Madhanika is tall, but her brother is Tash. What is the opposite word of tall? What is the antonym of the word tall? Come on. Tall. Tall ya ko the kyo na Short. Yes. Short is the opposite word for the word tall. And then strong. It is given like this. Radhika is strong, but the sister is dash. Strong. What is the opposite of strong? Come on. V, yes. V. In the same way, soft. Here, it is given like this. Silk is soft, iron is cash. Silk, soft. the opposite of soft, soft, yes, hard, hard, and then remember, what is the opposite of remember? What is the opposite of forever? Yes, forget. And then, next statement is here. So we can form opposite words by adding suffix or prefix. Some words are given here. 
you will have to classify them into prefixes and suffixes. Yes, here some words are given. Prefixes and suffixes. For example, read less full miss more meant able into suffix and prefix. Read. Is it a prefix or suffix? Read. Is it a prefix or suffix? Yes, it is a prefix and then less is it a prefix or suffix yes suffix can you use it in your sentence what are these colorless color colorless Water is tasteless. Tasteless. In suffix, we are going to add the word to the R at the end of the word. In prefix, we are going to add it in the beginning. Beginning of the word. Read. Can you, can you give me a word for this? Re, reassure, assure, reassure. Is it a prefix or suffix? 
yes it is a suffix move movement able is it a prefix or suffix s suffix move movable it is suffix friend friendship multi is it a prefix or suffix yes it is a prefix can you give an example yes multi story building yes i think you have understood all these items prefixes and of the suffixes and antonyms now now you come to your home assignment so here are some questions in the page number 5 you will have to answer all these questions first you have to read the lesson properly and then try to answer all the questions in c okay i think i hope you have understood the lesson properly so this is for your home assignment yes okay thank you